everyone and welcome back to my first playthrough of Red Dead Redemption 2. Today I want to go on a little treasure hunt. I read in the comments that there was a treasure not far from camp and I want to look for it. I wanted to find it in the last episode but uh, I didn't have enough time so I read some clues about how to find it. Apparently it's close to camp. It's in a little town, a little burnt out town uh, between the river and the camp so I, I, th I would think it's on this side and maybe it's here maybe it's here i don't know exactly where it is but i'm gonna look for it i don't think i've ever been here i'm not sure i'm not sure and we'll see what the day brings it's very rainy today it's very rainy um but it's okay yep Let's go back to camp. We're not too, too far. And now Sean's gonna be at the camp too. Because we got Sean last time. I don't know Sean at all. He seems younger than the rest of us. Yeah. I don't know, he looked pretty young. A prisoner? I'm not gonna mess with that. Get me out of this damn cave! No. Yeah. A little burnt out town. I read it was called Limpany or Limpani or something like that. Oh my gosh, I read in the comments that you some of you guys have a lot of hours in this game. I read like a thousand hours or something, more than that. Yeah. Some of you had like five playthroughs of this game. Wait, it could be that. It's burnt out. So I have a good feeling. I have no clue where it is. Or what it is. So, but you know what? We're gonna explore. I had no clue this was here. Okay, it doesn't say Limpani or Limpani. Maybe on my map. I'm gonna check. No, it doesn't say. Everything is burnt down. I'm going to use Eagle Eye. Can I climb this? I can. Now, where it is in town, I don't know. I don't know, but it's somewhere here. Could be hard to find because I don't know if it's in a chest or something or I don't think it's here not in this building what's this over there looks like um a crypt <laughs> I don't know what it is So far, I see nothing that can be picked up or... Wow. 
What's in here? Is it locked? It's not. Whoa, it's very dark. Ah, they left people there. The town burned and the prisoners in it, or oh, they just left them there. Whoa. I don't see... I can't open this. There's nothing here. Wow. Okay. I'm gonna check every building. The sheriff's office. Is this a logbox? Come on, give me something good. A recipe? I'm seeing something. Gold! I found a gold bar. How much is that? I don't know. Inspect documents? Okay, that's my recipe. So now I can craft special horse stimulant recipe. It needs... Sage, bulrush, wild carrot. I don't have that, but... I found my first gold bar. That's awesome! That's awesome. I'm gonna have to see how much it's worth. Okay, I'm just gonna check if there's something else to loot. I'm happy about that. Thanks for letting me know where that was. Or giving me enough clues so I can find it. I'm really happy about that. I'm so happy about that find. And I read also that I had to check the chimney, but I guess everything burned here. Okay. Oh, wait. I think, um, was this to find gold or something? Oh. Gridock root. There's fish right there. Okay. What time is it? I could, um... Hey there, mister. I could sleep uh, at the camp. Check on Sean. Look at the sky. This is... This is something else. Wow. Okay, come on, boy. Yep. Tomorrow, we'll see how much this gold bar is worth. I could bring back some food for Pearson. Okay, let me hunt. hard to hunt at night. Might not be the best, um, idea. But 
But if I can just catch one small animal... I don't see it anymore. <gasps> okay, it's right there. can barely see it though, but... I got it. I got it. It's a poor pelt. But it's okay. Come on, boy. Uh, where are you? Can I stow? Yeah. I don't know what's the max to stow. Guess we'll find out. Yep. Yeah. Come on, let's go back to camp. There's a music icon at the camp. Why? A camp party? <laughs> I never saw that before. Wait, I have to check it out. Come on, that looks fun. Yeah, not, um, not through there. There. I want to get to the party. Okay, I'm gonna feed you. There you go. Eat that. Sean. Sean's right there. Even you. Where are they? Camp party says this way though. And don't you worry, Miss Grimshaw, you old crone. I'll keep them girls in line. If I have to whip them, I will. And you get a bump on the head, too. And don't you worry, Mr. Pearson, you drunk old shitbag. It'll be nothing but that. It's not here. It's this one? Now, dead eye Maguire's back. And don't worry about nothing, Mrs. Grimshaw. We'll have this camp running like clockwork. I love you, bastards. <laughs> I don't know where they are. Have lots of fun. <laughs> <laughs> I can hear the girls. Where are they? Uh-oh, here comes trouble. I can't get rid of you, can I? Am I trouble? I suppose. You all right? Yeah, it's good to have him back. Let's see if we're still saying that in a day or two. And, um... CD? How are you doing, Mrs. Adler? Uh, not really in the party mood. She hates it. I understand. Well, she's a widow, so... Oh, uh, they're there. <laughs> Wait, I'm gonna have stew! There, Dutch. Start singing. Oh. 
Oh, that's cute. Okay, everyone's in good spirit. Dutch is fine. But how about something a little more civilized? Ah, it's good to be back. That was her shit. It says, um, what's this on the map? Drinking? That's right. And, and if you can tell the difference between a... The, the difference between a sheep and... I'm always at camp in the morning, so... I never saw that. Well, you, that. That makes you a better man than me, sir. And that's all I'm saying. Mark my words. All of you, mark my words. I don't know Bill very much. Stupid army. Sheep. Okay. Oh, that's cute. Okay, I'm gonna go to bed. I love them. So... I have a flower. I saw that before, though. Today... I'm gonna shave. Just a trim. I'm growing out my mustache. Because I want to be able to style it eventually. It's getting big. It's getting there. Hi, Dutch. Real heavy in Blackwater, Dutch. Posters of you and yeah, Jose things are bad. Set. All the more reason to stay well away for now. Yeah. I got no intention of going back anytime soon. I'm gonna give some food to... What's this? Wait. Item request? The case of the deceitful German? It's a mystery. About what, though? A new adventure was about to begin. Aldous Filson? Filson was a detective, yogi, sage, scientist, organist, raconteur, occasional thief, patriot, and expert in a thousand other subjects besides. But what happened? Only a fool would trust a man like that? He was a peddler? Filson was no fool. Oh no, wait. The Baron wanted to make a deal? Filson disarmed the Baron. Tell me just who you are and what you're doing. I'm the Baron von Schwarzhart. He gasped. Stood before us was not a German at all, but even worse. A woman! 
So there was a woman who was dressed as a baron. Okay. You have, um, strange literature. But wait. Hosea enjoys crime novels. Find one for him. Oh! Okay. I didn't know that. Hi, Charles. Go hunting? Not at the moment. But I'm gonna give some food to Pearson. For the camp. If you say so, Dutch. What are we gonna do? Is Dutch? I, I mean, he's always found a way, but lately, I, I know, dear. Wait, I, uh, I'm gonna donate. Have a choice but to ride this train to the end of the line. This stew is decidedly lacking on decent meat, Mr. Morgan. Think of the boy and make plans. There, see, I have food for you. Wish John would. I can always get more, so take all of it. Thank you, Arthur. Oh. What time did I go to sleep? <laughs> They're hungover. You and Sean seem to enjoy the party then? Oh, shut up. What I didn't I know Karen liked Sean. I think that's what they meant. Sean. Oh no, that's Reverend. I mistook you for the other redhead. Are you still drunk? You all right, there, Reverend? Reverend? Yes. Yes. Happy to have young Sean back. Yep. Wait, what's this here? Oh. Oh, was he married? That's his kid. And his wife, I think. Um, hi, Javier. You busy, Arthur? Rob a homestead? Not too busy. Why? I heard about a house. Tell me more. It could be interesting. What kind of a house? I don't know. A couple fellas I heard in town, they said... Said it was really... Freakish. A freakish house? Family local boogeyman, I guess. But they're huh? crooked in every way. So? Well, so these boys thought they were sitting on a lot of cash. And they're highway robbers, kidnappers, apparently. They're, they're bad well people. well hidden in the woods. That sounds pretty hmm. dubious. Of course. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's dubious, but there ain't much risk of getting caught. Okay, then. Yeah, I, um... Let's go take a look. We could do it. Exactly. Just take a look. Okay. Oh. Uh, on the other side of the river from Valentine. Best way there is to Cumberland Falls, though. You know it? Sure. Have I been there, Cumberland Falls? Hi, Susan. Okay. Come on, rabbit. Let's go with Javier. A freakish house? What does he mean? Whoa! Okay, we're pretty close now. Let's stop and go on foot from here. Just I'm hearing some gunshots. Follow me. Wait! I have my guns. It's fine. There's a spot up ahead where we should be able to get a good look at the place. I want to make sure we don't run into any surprises. Sure. Apparently, we're gonna scout. Nice yeah. For so long, they started talking in their own weird dialect. They really don't like outsiders, especially on their turf. <sighs> well, you just keep selling me on this. Job, well, we're don't robbing you? them, so. <laughs> of course, they don't want us here. Oh. What's this? Place, right? You 
So what should we do? I do. They're right here. Well, there's a pretty big barn in the back. It's not a bad place to start looking. There must be a lot of people living here. A large house. This desk could be in any one of them buildings, and who knows how many people are in there. <clears throat> I ain't sure about this. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? I, I think we need to draw them out somehow. And... I got an idea. Follow me. Can we do this without killing anyone? All these trees, I can't get a proper look at the place. Well, hopefully it'll make it harder for them to spot us, too. Coast seems clear so far. Yeah, so far. Yeah, I don't see anyone. I don't hear anything. Oh yeah, I do. I do. Come on. Let's hide behind this shed. See if we can hear what they're saying. Okay, you go ahead, Javier. Just stay quiet. Maybe use Hunter Pig this time once mouth. Where you been now, Newt? Don't be boiling now, Pappy. I's gone for ten minutes, I was. You're gonna holly gag all the now day long. Cause Edie takes patrol now, don't you? What? Yo, oh, Edie, get all the jam. You shut your gulper, or I'll flag her your belt, I will. <laughs> your niece will pull it up, boy. Up. What's he doing? Go! You understand what they're saying? Not much. Of it. No, I don't. What are we doing out here? Okay, you take cover by the rock over there. I'll create a little distraction, and then you jump them, okay? What kind of distraction? You'll see. Okay, they can't see me though. Okay. By that rock, he said. Here? Oh, wait. What are we doing? Oh, swanking heck. So they're going to go check? <laughs> what the hickory happened here? I don't know where they're from. Okay, we're just attacking them. Okay. He died. 
he died. And you? here cover scent I'm not seeing a stash though has to be under here there's no place else I could store it can Got I it. help you push I'm Give hearing some hand. people though Lock box. We have here. Well, well, well. How much? I told you it was worth the trouble, didn't I? Yeah. You take this. Let's split up. I'll meet you back at camp. Right, sounds good. That's a big stack of yeah. bills. How much? <coughs> it doesn't say. Wait, I want to check in the house. Can I? There could be like a um, cigarette card or... These are cigarettes. I'm just going to check quickly. There's nothing. Oh, some gun oil, but... I'm full. There's a map here. I can't take it, though. What's this? A medical box? Full. Nothing. Nothing at all. There's another room on this side. Oh. Come on. A weapon case? checked what is what is this it looks like a shoddy okay weapon in poor condition but i mean i already have it so i'm gonna take my bow Okay, I'll be off. There's nothing else I can loot. There's some stuff here, bourbon, but I'm full. So. Okay. Okay. 
Is there anything I missed? I mean, I didn't check that house. A bread chunk. Awesome bait. There's some stuff in here. <gasps> yes, a cigarette card. I'm happy about that. I'm so glad I checked. And cigarettes, I have enough. Okay, I hear, um, I don't know if it's rabid, but there's a horse that's pretty agitated. Not gonna hurt you. Javier said to meet him back at camp. Go back to camp. We found some money yep. and Whoa. Oh, we're north of Valentine. Oh. I could visit Mary Linton. And where's the doctor's office? Because one of you told me to check behind his office in Valentine and that there'd be something interesting. Yeah. So I'll take a look. And maybe we could stop by and visit Mary Linton. Because um, she sent us a letter. And um, she seemed... Hey, like someone Arthur cared about at some point. And I've been wondering about that, if he ever loved someone. There's no one here? Okay. Boy. Hey there, partner. Hey. So I decided to go hunting, and it got pretty late. So I'm just gonna camp out. I'm not far from Valentine. I think Valentine is right there. Actually. Yeah. So I'm just gonna camp out quickly, and in the morning I'll check, um... I'll check on Mary. Come on, boy. I hunted some badgers. A buck. Oregano venison. Wow. Okay. I never saw that before. I'm gonna sleep until the morning. Mary Linton. I wonder. What's their history? Come on, boy. Um, wait.
It's very early, so I'm not gonna knock on her door at 6 a.m. I'm gonna take a bath. Oh, wait. Wait a minute. There's a butcher right there. So, I could sell my pelts. Good to see you back. Hi, sir. It's just gonna take a moment. Rough night, I see. There. Have a great day. Thanks, partner. Okay, boy. I'm gonna take a quick bath. Because I've been on the roads for a while. And I don't know what this Mary Linton is to me. So you know. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Welcome Hi, back. sir. Can I'd I like to um, I got have a warming quick up bath. For you already. Just head down the corridor there. Well, thank you. I'll be quick. Ah, uh, the life. The life! Would you like someone to take over for you? Well, hello, Bath Mama. Um, yes. Well, no, actually. Maybe another but thank time. you. It's a whole process, this bath. There! I didn't know stamina could increase when you wash. Well, that's great to hear. That shopkeep across the way has been selling out his room for cheap. But I hear there's goddamn sidewinders hot out in his pillows. Well, that's good to know. I'll keep that in mind. Have a great day, sir. Thanks. Okay. I'll be careful in the mud. Let's, uh, let's brush you. There. Have a bite. There, boy. And just before seeing Mary Linton, as I said, I read in the comments there's something behind the doctor's office, so I'm just gonna check it out. Oh. What's this? Some O'Driscolls? Yeah, but just wondering what you boys are up to. You're beating on this man. Move along, we'll get you next. Oh, oh they killed him. Okay. I just um I'll be on my way. So the doctor's office is right there. What could be behind it? It's not in there. I don't think so. Look. Why? Why? <laughs> you found a hidden operation? At the doctor. Don't make me call the I can now rob the shop's side business? Huh? Was this, uh... It's me. Come on, the deputy. Up. 
Here. Now you go keep the people safe. You better all be there. Yeah, yeah. I'll be back to check on you tomorrow. Did I see an old Driscoll in there? They don't mind that I saw that. What's going on? Uh, hi! Hi there. What do you want? This is private. Get lost. Okay. Um... What do I do? What am I supposed to do with this? I can rob the side business? Can I rob the front business? Hi hey sirs! Nice to meet you. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna take a look hey at the doctor's Don't office. I've seen you in here before. Customers Thank love you. the gum if you're in the I've never energy. been here. No getting sick if you chew too much. Take as much as you need. Wow. What do you sell? Let me have a look. Howdy. Oh. Fine. I hear okay. um maybe next time. You have a side business, or something's going on. Let what can I sell you? Stock up on my supplies. You don't want my cigarettes? Okay. I'm just gonna browse. You know? Can I weigh myself? No. What's going on in your um back room here? Back there, sir. Oh yeah? How about you stop that? I just wanna look. I hear um That's it. You get out now. You're starting to rile me now, pal. You get the hell out of here. What am I supposed to do with this? Okay, partner, whatever you say. I'll be on my way. Enough of that. Some shops run an illicit business on the side, exploring around a shop or getting a tip from a stranger. May expose the shop's unusual activities. Good morning to you. Oh, I said good morning. Time there? Sorry, I don't know. Yeah? You okay? Can rob any shop? I don't want to rob the shop. Hi, folks. I'll be back because I have to figure this out. There's so many strange things going on. Don't know why I'd be up here, but... I don't need to be up here. You're right about that. Okay, there's nothing here. I mean, if there is... I don't see it just yet, so I'll have to. Um... How do you want me to be? Well, I love you. You don't love anyone, not me, not your wife, no one. Oh, you're impossible. Impossible? Really? I've wasted years on you, and I'm impossible. You're married too. You can be impossible. <laughs> impossible. You are a sad little small town. He's fighting with, um... A rat. A rat who thinks he's a cat. That's your problem. Go to hell. One time, I went into the sheriff's office. 
and he was uh, talking with a lady. And when I entered, they acted as if um, they'd be doing something. They were doing something, or I had bothered them or something. So, there's something going on. Hi, Howdy. sir. I'll be off. Okay. I don't know how to rob this uh, side business. But I'll look into it. Interesting. I thought it was a treasure or something. But I found a business. Hmm. Okay, we'll be back. Let's go see Mary Linton. Who is she to me? Who is this Mary Linton? She has a nice little house. The letter said that um, they stopped talking after she went away to get married, but something, either something didn't work out or I don't know what happened. We loved once and true. Yes. Oh, I'm oh. sorry, I didn't mean to disturb you, man. That's not Mary Linton. Uh, is, um... Is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. Mrs. Linton? A collar for you. A collar? <laughs> A gentleman collar? Mary! Hello, Arthur. She's pretty. Wow. Mary? I heard you and your friends was around. I... Okay. Okay? Where's what's his name? Died. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Really? Yeah. Me too. Her fiancé? Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So... Oh, uh, it's so tense. Well, you've been... <clears throat> you've been made a widow and... You come here looking for me, is that it? No, ain't like that, Arthur. Oh, okay. I... My family... I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. <laughs> I oh, always liked tell? Jamie. At least compared to the rest of them. He's broken Daddy's heart. <laughs> Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life. Me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Oh, Little Jamie's kind of... joined the Chelonians. That strange religious order. I heard Freedom. about a cult. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but... But I think of you often. A long time ago now. Yeah. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life and not the mm. nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Please, Arthur. It's kind of sad. Will you help me? I mean, of course I'm going to help Mary. But it's sad that she only wants to see me because she needs help, though. Where is it? Somewhere out near Carmody Dell, I think. The rancher there said he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest area. I've been there. I just want him back, Arthur. 
Isn't that if where I stole the... Bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I The wagon? Do. With Hosea? I'll owe you. You already owe me. I don't want her to owe me. I want her to love me, rabbit. She only wanted to see me because she needs help. Boy. I'll do it. I'll do it. For old time's sake. Where's her brother? Hmm. It's a trek. It's a trek, but I've been wondering about that cult. I wonder if that's the weird cult that loves turtles. The blind man was talking to us about. You know what? I'll have a look. So her fiance died or husband it's unclear i don't know if she actually married the guy not that it matters but um i feel like there's some unfinished business some unresolved problems of the heart. Mm. I'll do it. I'll do it for the love we once had. I think she cares for me. Ma'am? Oh, hey, you there! Think you could help a lady out? My horse up and died on me, twisted my ankle something fierce. Think oh. you could give me a ride? We'll hop yeah, on. Sure. Where hop are you on. going? Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you. You know <laughs> Emerald Ranch? Mind taking me there? I do. It's a small detour, sure. but come Glad on, ma'am. I ran into you. Huh. I raised that horse, you know. Raised it since it was just a foal. I'm sorry oh, to hear, ma'am. The horse is hard. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, that horse did right by me. Better than my husband, truth be told. Oh. That fool. Always complaining. But does he do something about it? Man barely lifts his hand to wave the flies away. Aside from to lift a drink, of course. Marriage for me has been nothing but trouble. But Biscuit? He was a fine animal. Biscuit? Lord, smart. I love biscuits. Brave. Didn't take no guff, not from no one. Had one of them mountain boys pull a gun on me once. I was riding up near the Dakota and it stopped by a nice warm patch. Must have dozed off, but I wake up and find some nasty piece of work pointing a rusty shotgun straight at me. Oh, well, yeah? He gets wheezing on and I must have made some sort of noise because the next thing I know, Biscuit had nipped his ear clean off. Kicked his hide, too, as he was hollering away. Didn't think a man could run so fast. Oh, yeah? Yeah, had a good laugh on that one. <laughs> I tell the husband, what does he do? Should have never gone over there, honey, he says. Gee, thanks. <coughs> so, <laughs> you live at Emerald Ranch, then? For the time being, I was looking for work. They was looking for some help with the gardens. If I waited any longer for my husband to put food on the table, I'd have died of starvation. I'll be moving on soon, though. Emerald Ranch, well, it's a strange place. I've heard some rumors. Oh, so. Yeah, Owners tell me more. Mean bastard. Strange, too. Delights in bullying folk. There's a daughter, but she never leaves the house. Jose I said the same the thing. Sometimes. When I asked about her, What's everybody up with told that? me to leave it alone. Yeah. Found an old saloon there. All shut down now. 
But I went in to have a look, and there's bullet holes, old blood stains. Something definitely happened there, but I couldn't figure it. Just an uncomfortable feeling to the place. Oh, we're getting so close there's now. There's a dark past. Hmm. Well, that was interesting. There. Here we go. This is great. This was kind of you, mister. Please it was my pleasure. This is my way of thanking you. What is it? Oh, wow. Appreciate it. Well, you have what a good day. A lousy day. Okay. I'm gonna ah. go see Mary. Uh, not Mary, but check on her brother. As I was saying, Mary Linton. I got my heart broken by Mary Linton. She chose someone else instead of me. That wasn't good enough for her. I mean, this life isn't, um, whoa, 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 whoa. It's okay, boy. These are wolves, I think. You're okay, boy. As I was saying... What was I saying? Yeah, I wasn't good enough for her. And this life... Isn't for everybody. I know. But... Me and Mary, there was something there. We loved each other. We loved each other. And what did she do with this love? She turned me down. Okay, boy. You're... You're okay, boy. He's gonna be fine, boy. Sorry, Are you okay? Boy. Okay, come on. Wait, I should save. I don't know these uh, cultists. one whistling. Am I? I don't think so. There we go. Okay, stay here, boy. I have a weird feeling. Shalonian master? I never heard of that term before. Everybody. Hello there. Would you be no, able to no help me out again? Of oh, the herbalist. <laughs> I could use some assistance gathering herbs for years ago. The great Chelonian master. Uh, well, of course, William. The Lanahassi into the wilderness. Uh, you see this purple flower here? I do. Place. But I'll need of to safety. experiment with more of it I before I can be sure of its effects. That. Is where we are heading. I found this Hummingbird sage is a stamina herb. I have plants for you. There. Oh, wait. There's a ceremony. My father. Your father will understand. Oh, yes. I feel ready to take on the world. I'll have trouble sleeping tonight. A man could go for days on this. You've had some moments, I'm sure. Some sage has made just be what you need. You have earned something for all your help. Well, thanks, William. 
I don't want to be late to the ceremony. This special ceremony. will set you right. No matter your wrong, is all the power the now. Thanks, William. Um, but there's business I need to attend to. Well, hello. Shell of safety. Shell of safety. Can I speak to the boy? Arthur? Hello, son. Your sister is very worried. The boy has chosen a path, sir. Has he? The path to truth. Well, I mean, his sister just wants to speak with him. Arthur, I've chosen a path. The boy has chosen a path. He's chosen safety. What path have you chosen, sir? Freedom. Um, but searching, hard to I tell. Guess. Yeah. We are all searching. Chelonianism is about searching. What do we search for, do you think? Stupidity? <laughs> I mean, a purpose? Probably. I don't know. <sighs> Safety? Safety and meaning? You like Jamie it. knows the truth. But of course, you may speak with him. Exactly. <laughs> if your teachings are so great, what harm can I do? Exactly. I'm, I'm not Whoa, 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 Jamie. I'm not coming with you, Arthur. Just come and speak with Mary. Then make up your mind. He Shut runs away. Home, Arthur. I didn't ask for your help. He knows I'm gonna bring him home. But Jamie! Why are you running? Why are you running? Little Jamie, I just wanna talk! They're just using you! Telling you what you wanna hear! What the hell do you know about it, Arthur? Yeah. Good point! Christ whoa, whoa, whoa. Jamie, just hold up a minute! Why are you running away, Jamie? I just want to have a few words. It's not gonna hurt. <laughs> he doesn't know what to expect of me. I'm just doing this for your sister. Good point. He runs for his life. Sorry, what are you gonna do, Jamie? Live the rest of your life in the mountains with no people? They're my friends. Yep. If you don't leave me alone, I'll shoot you. I swear it. <gasps> Jamie! What are you talking about? You ain't no killer. You don't know who I am. You're like a your brother to me. Don't, don't shoot at me. He wouldn't shoot me. Whoa. My horse getting tired though. <gasps> Jamie. Please, he got Arthur. away. I'm a man now. I, I found something. A calling. You're just a kid. You're making a big mistake. I'm not taking advice from you. You're an outlaw. You leave me alone. They're good people. I'm warning you, Arthur Morgan. <gasps> Leave me alone. Jamie. Please, kid. Put that gun down. I warn you, Arthur. I'm... I'm gonna... I don't want to live anymore. Kid, just calm down. Leave me Whoa. alone. Jamie, it's gonna be okay. No, 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 no. I don't want to... I don't want to... Okay. <gasps> oh my gosh, I thought. Let's go see your sister. I thought the worst. Okay. Oh, Jamie. Okay. 
He's kind of endearing. It's okay, kid. Oh. Have I been a terrible okay. fool, Arthur? I don't know. I don't know enough about it. See, they love turtles. <laughs> one thing I do know. That's so funny. There ain't no shame in looking for a better world. I missed you, Arthur. That's true. Are you and Mary sweet on one another again? Oh, no. Unfortunately, That's all not. That's a long time ago, son. It was like two years ago. Oh, well, hmm. this wasn't how I thought today would turn out. It's been a long time, Jamie Gillis. You were a kid last time I saw you. you didn't try to kill yourself. You know, you taught me how to ride a horse. Too well, apparently. Shalonia That's though, why he went so fast. Really? You'd fall for that? They were very nice to me. They're decent. I'm sure. Please tell me you didn't give them any money. Of course I did. They rely on charitable donations. Jesus, Jamie, come on. <laughs> I just wanted to believe that there might be something good coming my way one day. Guess that's dead in the water. With the it's not dead in Shut the water. Up. You're still young. All father kept telling me was, you won't amount to anything. You're not enough of a man. I had to get away. I couldn't take you anymore. Forgive me, but your father's a bully and a coward. Don't listen to him. Hey, don't talk about him like that. What do you want me to say, Jamie? He's a good father, nice man. He won't be happy I saw you. Please send him my worst regards. <laughs> the thing is, he's right. I'm not good at anything. Come on. That ain't true. That's not Tell true, Jamie. Uh, well, um, Don't think too hard. Apples, I guess. Apples? Huh? Yeah, I love apples. Okay. That's Don't a start. More along the lines of <laughs> carpentry or horses or something. But, all right, go work in an orchard then. By that token, you must really like shooting and robbing people. I only like shooting young idiots who run away from me when I'm trying to help them. Father told me what you do. I'm sure he did. Hey, are you still with Dutch and what was his name? H Hester? Okay. Hester? Yep, oh. still the same, sort of. And Annabelle and Bessie? I'm afraid they're dead. Shit. Maybe Mary did make the right choice. Here we are. She must be waiting inside. Okay, Jamie. <laughs> Come on now. Oh, that's a beautiful we horse. Is that then? Mary's horse? We're going in. Just gonna hitch my horse. Oh, you're all dirty, rabbit. It's okay. I'll be back. Come on, Jamie. Make it quick or I might run off again. Don't try me, Jamie. Oh, I like the You're music. It's kind of nostalgic. Jamie! Jamie! Oh, come home. Please, you've... Father's been very sad. Father wouldn't know sadness if it died in his bed. <laughs> but I'll come home okay. for you. My boy. My sweet boy. Come on. Oh, Arthur. They're leaving? Thank you. Thank you. She was just there to... It's good to see you, Mary. ...get her brother. And you, Arthur. And you. That's it. But Mary... She still loves him. I think. I've. You're. Oh, you'll never change. I know that. Oh. Don't say that. And why do I need to change? What's so bad about me, Mary? Hmm. 
Oh, that was... that was sad. That was sad. I feel like mm -hmm. the luckiest man alive and I feel like a fool. That woman confuses me and plays me for a fiddle like no one else alive. I trust I will not make a god-awful fool of myself once more, but... Somehow, I imagine I shall. Oh, that's tough. That's tough. I really like that mission. I want to know more about Mary and Arthur. And I hope I get to see her again. I have to. There's unfinished business there. Howdy. Oh, hi, sir. You mind the way? Yeah. Oh, I like that one. And I finally met the Shalonians. Kind of a weird group there. There's all sorts of secrets, I feel like, and mysteries in this um in this world. I really like it. That's awesome. I hope you enjoyed it too. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.